Hey, how it going? This is uh, William Sensei. So, just uh, like I mentioned yesterday, we're going to talk about the uh, playbook that came out in June, just on Tuesday evening, Japan time. And here's what it says. So, this is a big warning to all the athletes coming to Japan. First off, they said, follow the rules. Follow the rules or you're going to get a warning of something may happen bad for your uh, game's experience. Now, they didn't say exactly what's going to happen bad if you don't follow the rules. Uh, but they just said a warning or fines or uh, that type of thing. But, of course, Japan government can deport anybody if they feel like it also. So, we shall see how far they go. But, here's are the basic things that they need to do. All the athletes. First, mask wearing. So, they must be wearing a mask at all times except when eating, training, or actually during their competition, or sleeping. That's it. So, if you see any athletes out there partying without a mask, you report them. <laughs> right. Next, minimize physical interaction. And hopefully I can, I can copy this and put it up. Uh, but number one thing is keep physical attraction. <laughs> physical interaction. Of course, physical attraction is going to happen. But physical interaction <laughs> at a minimum. Right? Uh, so avoid handshaking, number two. And hugs, that's no no. And try to keep number three, a two meter distance away from other people. And number four, avoid enclosed spaces where crowds and people are. Okay. And number five, um, use dedicated game vehicles. Right. So they cannot use public transportation, unless it's the only way to reach certain locations, such as remote venues, right? Only carry out the activities submitted in your activity plan at places on the list of permitted destinations. Now, here's another hard thing that's going to, they're going to have to do. Test, trace, and isolate. So basically, Everyone coming into the country will need to download this online check-in health report app. O-C-H-A. Right? And Japan's own contact confirmation application, COCOA. C-O-C-O-A. Right? And familiarize yourself with any other technology uh, that may be needed to help with the COVID-19. Um, they need to prove they are tested of negative results before departing the games. And you'll be tested once you arrive in Japan. Um, you're going to have regular COVID-19 uh, screening test during the games as required for your role. If you experience any symptoms that are told by the Japanese health authorities... If your test is positive, you will need to isolate. So if you're feeling bad and you say, hey, I'm not feeling good, the doctor and said you're positive, you need to isolate. Now the big question is, okay, if they isolate and if it's on one team, does that mean their whole team is out? So that, that's a really big question. Because if, if, if they've been in close contact with their other team members, you would think, okay, the whole team's got to be Got to be done. So that'll really impact the Olympics, I think. So this is a, uh, not a well thought out plan in that respect. <laughs> All right. Um, and of course, the health and hygiene, what I always promote every day, wearing the mask, washing the hands. Um, and also for uh, applause, you're only supposed to be using a table sheet. But no screaming. Right? None of that. They don't want any screaming. 
or chanting like USA, USA. Damn it. <laughs> Whatever your country is, you cannot yell out. Uh, so, and then avoid using shared uh, materials like pins and timers and Coke bottles and whatever, you know. And they want you to ventilate the rooms. Okay, okay. So that's enough for today. How many more days to go before the Olympics? 36 days to go. 36 days to go. 30, 30, 30, 30, 36. Alright, so 36 days to go before the Olympics. So, yeah, I will give you some more Olympic updates as uh, as they come in. Um, so, look out for that. And, as for my activity, we will have some online training uh, next week. And then a week before the games start, then we'll have another training, I believe, at the venue itself. So that's when I'll be able to go to the venue itself. So that'll be within the 10 days to go period. So hopefully we can film a little over there too. Okay. So be safe. Mask up, wash the hands, keep the COVID-19 out of your system. <laughs> and we look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. All right, that's all for today. Bye-bye.